big day. Season 13, I can't believe we've been doing Night's News for 13 years. As I get older, I uh, tend to be a little more laid back in my approach. It's 9.15, I'm just now arriving to school. I mean, they've been working hard, I'm sure. Not a student entrance. Not a student. So we're gonna check in on them, see if the show's ready, see if we can do this thing. I'm sure they've got a good, I don't even have to raise my, vo I don't even have to raise my voice at this group. Hey guys, uh, you ready to go? Got the new intro ready and everything, you guys good? What hey, no, 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 don't go anywhere. Oh, not again. I'm not gonna have this happen. You know what? I'm, I'm really upset. You guys stay in this room. You know what? You think about what you've done. You stay here in the dark and you come up with a new intro. They'll get it done. I'm a good leader. <laughs> you got two black eyes from loving too hard and a black car that matches your blackest soul. I wouldn't change it. And I'm Emma Schmidt. And welcome to season 13 of Night's News. Here are your daily announcements for September 14th, 2018. We are looking for students interested in volunteering for Night's Fest on October 12th after school. If you're interested, please email ptfnightsfest at charcrice.com for more information. When you get forms for On Campus Now, make sure you sign up. There's a National Honor Society meeting today during lunch and Mr. Ross room. So bring your lunch, our star. <laughs> CCS students, if you did anything fun over the summer and would like it to be featured in the yearbook, email your pictures to ccsyearbook2019 at gmail.com. If you're interested in joining the varsity swim team, sign up in Mr. Hoff's room 306. They will have a mandatory lunch meeting during Friday, September 21st in his room. This year we are only accepting 35 students to attend the Harvard Model Congress, so make sure to sign up. There will also be an informational meeting in Mr. Hoff's room on Monday, September 24th during lunch. Make sure to sign up. If y'all are interested in going to the DC March for Life, sign up in either Dr. Headley or Mr. Hoff's room. There's going to be an informational meeting on October 1st in room 306 during lunch. If you are participating in bubble soccer at Windy Gap, you must have a signed waiver. Please pick up the waiver in the front office. If Mrs. Fair does not have your waiver by Monday before you get on the bus, you will not be able to play. If you haven't voted for homecoming court, vote today. And here's today's lunch menu. Vegetable soup, grilled chicken alfredo bake, pasta primavera, garden peas, yellow squash, and grilled chicken alfredo bake with gluten-free pasta. Enjoy. Enjoy! Upcoming colleges today, St. Michael's College at 9.30 and Gardner-Webb at 1. Thursday the 20th, Babson College at 1.15, and Friday the 21st, Grand Canyon University at 1.15. Happy birthday to Sheldon Jackson, Trey Slaughter, Finn Stokely, Jack Littlefield, Jack Jessa, Noah Bierman, Victoria Haynes, and Julie Bug. Rob Burris, Thomas Young, Carter Goodrich, and Michael Whittle. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! That's what we have for today, Charlotte Christian. Enjoy the show! Look at that girl. Her face. What? Look at her face. Look. Vime is dead, but as Charlotte Christian, it is still very much alive. Let's see if our students can finish these vines. Finish that vine. Country boy. I love you. Uh. I want a church girl who goes to church. And read her Vimeo. Hurricane Katrina. More like Hurricane Tortilla. Hello, my name is... Trey, and I have a basketball game tomorrow. What's nine plus ten? 24. What's 9 plus 10? 21. Who's the hottest Uber driver you've ever had? Uh, I've never been to Uvu Java. I'm in my mom's car. Vroom, vroom. A potato. Flew around my room before you came. You. I don't care that you uh, broke your elbow. I love Chipotle. I actually don't know this one. Chipotle is my life. You got a bay? 
for nah. You trying to date? Or nah. Just went to Del Taco. Free shampoo do. What did you do? I shaved my eyebrows. Why? I don't know. Happy birthday, Raven! I can swim! I can't believe. <laughs> what? I can't believe. I can't believe you've done this. Hi, I'm Ziggy. I'm a sophomore and I love to bake. Hey guys, my name is Will Allen and I'm a junior. You should go subscribe to Will Allen Productions. I'm Alex. I'm a junior and I love fun backpacks. My name's Natalie, I'm a junior, and I like to play volleyball. I'm Thomas, I'm a senior, and I play golf. You probably already know that. Hello, my name's David. I'm a senior, and I'm a 10-time pro with Tetris. That was perfect. Hello, my name is Quem Wesley. And I'm Mar Marty, Man Marty, Man Man Marty Mandels. And we are Winnie Gap gurus, if you might say. We're basically travel agents, but only for Winnie Gap and the greater area of the Smoky Mountains. Main thing to realize when you go to Winnie Gap is that you're going to need to bring things to help you on the way. So here's a couple of lists of things that you'll need to bring. Flashlight. Toothpaste. Toothbrush. A sleeping bag. Pillow. Bug spray. A Bible. A notepad to take all your notes with. A topography map of our very own Great Smoky Mountains. A dream capture. Roundup. And as always, a letter from your pastor or local congressman. My favorite thing to talk about Windy Gap is my favorite things about Windy Gap. When you come to Windy Gap, you might want to indulge a little bit. And I would do that in a fine game of dodgeball. The thrill of the competition, the sweat dripping on the concrete. That's what real sports are. Now while you're there, you might want to go like a beeline down to the horse stables. And it's probably one of my favorite things to do. We aren't allowed what? to do that. What? We aren't allowed to go there. I like going up to the top of the mountain and just looking out, seeing the horizon, wishing I could be a bird, a blue jay, a robin, maybe even a falcon. As I'm chained to these shackles that bind me to the ground, My favorite thing to do at Windy Gap is go out between four and five in the morning when the dew is at its freshest point, and I go out and I roll around in it. I enjoy a nice leisurely stroll by myself through the forests, where I just watch the squirrels where they hide their acorns so that I can come back and get them for myself. I let them do all the work so I get all the reward. I love the red flannel blankets. You ain't real if you can't sleep with one of those. Now, a thing that you might want to indulge yourself in is when you're here is a nice old grasshopper. Green, delicious goodness, just. Oh, I love that crunch. Just get them out when you're, get, get out there early in the morning when you're rolling around in the dew if you can pick up a grass, grasshopper or two. Nothing like it. I was talking about the drink. part of Windy Gap is I like to arrive a few days before the middle schoolers with a gallon of brown paint and I climb up in the rafters of a cabin and paint myself like the ceiling and I just hang there and I'm like, wait and then and then at night I can just open my eyes and I can see all the happenings of the night. <laughs> 